Welcome to UFT 1450. This video highlights some of the new features available in this release. Parallel Execution Speed up your testing time in UFT with Parallel Execution for Web Tests. While Parallel Execution for Web Testing is still in tech preview in this release, Parallel Execution for Mobile is now fully supported. Run a single mobile or web test on multiple environments or even multiple tests on multiple environments simultaneously. Trigger parallel test runs from Jenkins and view aggregated run results for all tests run in parallel from a single report. Mobile testing. This release also includes additional support for Mobile Center's multi-project and workspace features. New mobile testing methods for Face ID simulation for iOS and barcode or QR code simulation, as well as support for Android's Recycler View objects. AOM support for SRF. Optimize your UFT automation scripts with additional support for remote testing and StormRunner functional. Use new methods and properties in the Web Launcher object, as well as the new Web SRF settings object, to define your record and run settings for SRF. Spy in Hover Mode UFT's Object Spy now supports the ability to spy on an object by hovering over it instead of clicking. Enable hover mode before you spy, and then hover over your object to capture its properties. Branching in BPT. Add additional structure to your BPT tests using branches, which enhance your tests with decision-making capabilities during runtime. In each branch, define actions depending on the application's runtime status. You can modify branch conditions and options in both UFT and ALM. Technology Stack Leverage UFT's extended technology support. UFT now supports additional software versions and more. To learn more, check out the UFT Help Center. Thanks for watching!